The bold and the beautiful spoilers have been revealed for May the 23rd and 24th so let us find out everything revealed so far. B and B spoilers for May 23rd. We begin the Thursday May 23rd episode with the central wedding story. It is Sheila and Deacon's special day but let us tell you everything is strange about the ceremony. First off we have Sheila choosing to wear a fitting yet still odd wedding dress that is black and then she has picked homeless Tom to be the officiant. The latter does not seem that bad an idea as Tom has cleaned up well and looks presentable in a suit. Yes, Clint Howard will play Tom again. He will be dressed up in his homeless attire for two days of episodes, after which he will marry them. It is only right because he made their reunion possible to each his own, but it's sort of lovely to have a homeless guy perform your wedding ceremony. B and B Spoilers May 24th The nuptials take place on Friday May 24th. So, it appears that this Friday will be yet another suspenseful one. Of course, at the wedding, something unexpected occurs. We're curious to see whether Steffi turns up and causes a stir. There could well be a riot if Brooke, Ridge and the rest of the hate group arrive. Together, we'll find out soon enough in the next couple of days. B and B Spoilers Unknown Dates We wanted to share them with you even though they are not dated. Sheila's happy-looking fiancé Deacon greets her as she comes down the aisle at Illinois Giardino. Despite wearing a black dress, Sheila looks stunning, and Finn promises Steffi that nothing will come before Kelly and Hayes. I still believe he will end up at that wedding, though. In addition, spoilers have shown snippets of Brooke arguing with Hope and Tom, the homeless guy, coming dangerously near to identifying Deacon and Sheila as husband and wife. There will undoubtedly be drama over this. We believe they will have their opportunity and lead a somewhat happily ever after. These are all the spoilers we have for you today, come back for more new ones to our channel.